Hey guys, this is Ash here from the Network Studios. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys some screenshots of the new Owls of Man TT game. So there's a couple of screenshots of some of the bikes, what we're going to be able to ride in the game. And there's also a couple of screenshots what I've thrown in of some of the parts of the course. And I must say, guys, I am very, very excited about this game. I made a video on this game about a week nearly two weeks ago and it did fairly well on views compared to some of my other videos so I thought I would kind of try and keep you updated about this game by the way if you did not know the Owls of Man TT are making a new game this year and it is set to release in November this year so we've got some really nice screenshots we have got the grandstand the start line in my opinion this is like my favorite part of the course because it's it's obviously where you start the the race it's where you start the the, the best and probably most dan one of the most dangerous um, race race events in the world and in my opinion like it's just there in it you're putting your visor down and you're just setting off and going down bray hill and um, this was when they put a picture up on their official facebook page three days before the tt was actually starting for real so it actually is quite old this screenshot but you can see develop in progress development so that's pretty you know they're still working on it got a nice um, picture of quarter bridge here just look how realistic it looks like the arrows on the mini painted roundabout um, just the buildings and ju just everything in general really like just looks so realistic and so nice you can just see like how this game is going to come together all the detail that the company is putting into this game and i am for one very very excited about this one definitely cannot wait to see this game when it's released so we have another picture here of a bike that is going to be um in the game and um it actually looks like a really nice bike the fairing on it the colors just absolutely looks so nice um so nice 2016 um it's mark killer's bike it's absolutely uh, amazing look at it like we're going to be able to race this thing that's you know that's what i'm saying like this is going to be so sick we've got another bike here we've got the yamaha yzfr6 and uh this is michael dunlop's bike so we're actually going to be able to race his bike in the game which is going to be absolutely sick as well i just can't wait till i'm like playing the game lining up on the grandstand um, and just setting off like that's going to be so so sick for me um when i'm like obviously able to do that and um we're coming into another bike now as well i've got another bike uh, to show you and uh, this is another bike this is another yamaha as well i think i may be oh yeah this is the same bike but this is just a different angle um of that same bike but this is absolutely sick now if you do want me to do updates because they do release more stuff about the game they have a facebook page and they will release more stuff so if you want me to update you guys a bit more about this game then just go ahead and let me know because this is, you know, like, this is something I could potentially keep updating you with. And we're going to come on to the final picture, my favourite. We have got Braddon Bridge. Now, the absolute just beauty in this screenshot with the footage of the church and the sun. And just, like, the road markings, like, everything about him. The thing is, guys, is I've actually sat at Braddon and actually watched the racing. And that sort of, like, Bennett's advertisement thing at the side like if you go to the real course it actually says bennett's on it like the actual advertisement sponsors on the sort of like pillars at the side of the um road you know on the game it actually is what it actually is if if i'm making sense to you guys like like they, they've gone into that much detail to get it right that they're putting the actual real sponsorships in the game they're not like they're not like just getting the layout of it and then putting some made up stuff on they're actually going into detail um with this game and like i say i cannot wait to see this game um get released this is by far my favorite screenshot so far 
um, along with obviously the grandstand one, but I just love the detail of the church and even like the render distance because obviously you see where the people are stood and the road goes back a bit like on the old TT games it was just nothing like they only literally had like the visibility of the course whereas with the game you can actually look a little bit back up the street and it kind of like slowly fades out like it would in real it's absolutely phenomenal so yeah guys um i would like you to like subscribe and comment and we shall see you in the next video some great screenshots